What up, YouTube? Today's video, I'm going to give my reaction to this movie called Powder. Now, this movie is very, 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 very significant. It speaks, like, truth in volumes, like, literally. If you've never seen this movie called Powder, please go check it out, okay? It's really, really mind-boggling, and it's going to open up your mind. Now, this movie... I seen this on Vios. This movie is crazy, okay? It's like this guy, but like I ain't seen it in a minute, but I seen the whole movie, you know, so it's in my subconscious. But um it's this guy named Powder and he was born he was born albino, you know what I'm saying? Like he was a Caucasian male, but you know he was born albino, so you know, he looked like Seamus, you know, from WWE. But um he used to always sit in his room, like, and just, like, build stuff. He used to always have a lot of books and stuff, like, just reading. And he used to just sit along in the dark, you know, he used to do nothing. He was bald head, and, you know, he had inner powers, you know. He was one with nature. But the thing about it is Hollywood, they try to, you know, change some things. You know how they do, you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, the melanated man was the first man on this planet. Real talk, you know what I'm saying? Like... There's no other way around that, but they made them, you know, albino. You see what I'm saying? Like trying to throw you off, but that don't it don't really it don't even really mean about. I mean, <laughs> like skin color, that really ain't nothing, okay? But I'm just saying the fact that you know melanin is in everything, and they just made them albino. You know what I'm saying? But he was so powerful that he would just like spark stuff. Like he could just touch something, he'd spark. You know. When you touch a chair or something and you just like touch it and you get a zap. But his power was like to the to the T, you know what I'm saying? And I think his parents died in the movie. And I'm not for sure he got adopted, you know. But um, you know, people was bothering him, you know, bullies and shit always picking on somebody, you know what I'm saying? Cause he looked different, quote unquote. So, you know, he actually like shooting motherfuckers with electric balls and stuff, like all the stuff I was telling you, like send the energy out, man. Y'all gotta check that movie out, real talk, man. Like real talk. And he like like a superhuman like that's the best way i could put it and it gets to the part where um or you know i like i said i really ain't seen the movie in a, like in a like in a minute so you know i'm kind of touching on all the key important parts that i remember and you know it's this one part where um i think he was getting bullied but you know he did some shit it was like at a barn and shit and they had like a fight and then he set some shit on fire you know like just threw some energy and that shit just like blew everybody up and he ran and while he was running, and he was so powerful that he was running, like, uh, this fucking, um, thunderstorm cloud, like, it was, like, hella lightning in the sky, and it just, boom, just, like, zapped him up, you see what I'm saying, like, basically, that's basically Merkabah activation, you see what I'm saying, like, his magnetic, his magnetic force was so powerful that he didn't get killed, he didn't die, like, our ancestors, they, you know, a lot of our ancestors died, but our ancestors from way, way back, because that's what I'm trying to explain to people, like, think about it. You have your mama DNA, you got your grandma DNA, you got your uncle DNA, your brother and your sister and stuff like that. And then that's one generation. And then you go to your mother's mother. And then you go to all her people that was in her family, uncle, you know what I'm saying, like that. You go to the next generation, to the next generation. It goes so far back that you don't even know if one of your ancestors was an alien. You know what I'm saying? Because think about it. Civilization didn't start just on Earth. You see what I'm saying? Civilization moved to Earth once the bloodlines and stuff started developing, like, the, you know, along the line. You see what I'm saying? Because we on Earth because our parents reside on Earth. You said we could have been born on a different planet if you think about it. Like, really think about it. Where your genetics and all this stuff relied because we on this planet now. You see what I'm saying? But, like, your ancestors from back then, you don't even know if your ancestor was an alien or not. But that's what this movie's so significant about. It's just, like think about it like he got zapped up into a cloud that's Merkabah activation you see what i'm saying like he didn't get killed or none of that they just he went to a different dimension because his energy was that powerful like real talk man go check out this movie powder man real movie man I'm telling you like you got to be able to peep the scenes like real talk please peep the scenes